Hello friends, in this video demonstration, we are going to see how to install Kali Linux 2016.1 in Oracle VM VirtualBox. So for this demonstration, already I created the one virtual machine and uh, I just mount the ISO image of Kali Linux 2016.1 AMD 64 bit. So before you start the installation, you have to download the ISO image from Kali Linux website and just mount inside your virtual machine. So click on OK and let's start the virtual machine. In the first screen, you have to select the installation type. And here we have a boot menu. And from the boot menu, I'm going to select graphical installation options. So select graphical install and then hit enter key. Now in this console, you have to select the installation language. So for this demonstration, I'm going to select English. Then click on continue. Now here you have to select your location. So I'm going to select India. Click on continue. And here you have to configure the keyboard layout. So keyboard map will be American English for my case. Click on continue. So once the network configuration is complete, it will ask you to specify the host name for this virtual machine. So I'm going to specify call it Linux 2016.1 as a host name. Then click on continue. Now this will ask you to specify the root password. So let's specify the password. Let's re-enter the password to verify. Click on continue. Now this will ask us to specify the disk partitioning. Now here I'm going to select guided user enter disk for new user. Click on continue. And this is my uh, virtual hard drive. Select it and then click on continue. Now here we have options to all files in a one partition recommended for new user. You can create a separate home partition or you can select the separate slash home slash var and slash temp partition. But for this demonstration, I'm going to select all files in a one partition recommended for new user. Click on continue and here select finish partitioning and write changes to disk and then click on continue. Now it will ask us to specify write the changes to disk, select yes and then click on continue. Now the installation is begin. Now this will ask us about the configure the package manager. So do you want to use a network meter? I say no and then click on continue. So now this will ask about the install the grub bootloader on a hard drive. Select yes, install the grub bootloader on a master boot record, then click on continue. And now select, we want to install the grub bootloader on our hard drive slash dev slash sd and then click on continue. So now installation is complete. So it's time to boot into your new system. Make sure you remove the installation media so that you boot into new system rather than the restarting the installation. So click on continue. Now select Kali Linux and hit enter key. And now that's it. Now you can log into your newly installed system with the username root and the password which you set earlier. Then hit enter key. And now you have successfully installed the Kali Linux 2016.1 in Oracle VM VirtualBox. So the next step is to install the Oracle VM VirtualBox guest edition tool inside this virtual machine. So that's it for this demonstration. Thanks for watching this video.